Hey, what's up guys? I thought I'd do a little demo on the sticks that I use in my practice and playing because I get a ton of questions about what the hell I'm playing with. So uh, here we go. If you look to the this side here, these are the builder sticks, right? These are the sticks I use to strengthen the hands, the wrists, the fingers. Um, they're all, while well, these are Vic Firth Coremaster sticks, Ralph Hardeman's, Tom Ungst's, these are Promark. These are very, very heavy, the uh, Skojo stick. Great stick to, to really build up, you know, your chops. Moving in the center here, the, kind of the everyday snare stick that I use to make my videos and stuff like that. I, I do a lot of practice with these. I've worked with these for so long that I've kind of transitioned into this stuff because I don't necessarily need to play with the heavy stuff anymore. This stuff is still technically heavy. Um, Vic Firth SJ1. Um, you know, great snare stick, great practice stick, highly recommend that. And then the KP2s that I love, which are a very tapered um, stick that are light yet have good weight in the back and a very thick diameter as well. So they're very, very nice to play with. Moving here, we have my drum set arsenal. And uh, my everyday stick is a stick that Regal did for me. It's basically a long 5A, and I've been using that for almost a decade. These yellow ones I keep around because Eric Moore gave these to me, and I, I think they're Zildjian. Um, they're definitely in a 5A profile. They're, they're long as well, but they got such a nice balance to them that I, I, I can't part with them, and I don't destroy them on the drum set. I kind of keep them around. I do use a Vic Firth 5A. It's, you know, it's a classic stick, and it feels great. And then for jazz, sometimes you'll see me with an AJ1. And uh, these from Regal as well. The Jake Hanna nylon tip stick. These were probably the first sticks I ever played as a drummer when I was a kid. Um, I think my dad gave me a pair of Jake Hanna's. They look a little different, but they're the same stick. And then last but not least, the 7A nylon or wood, doesn't matter. These are for very articulate, intricate, kind of light jazz playing, um, small club stuff, you know, but a cool stick nonetheless. Also good to occasionally train with a light stick because it's the complete antithesis of working with this heavy stuff. And it helps develop other little parts of the muscle that you miss when you're doing the big stuff. So that's the rig rundown. And also just to comment on the snare I use daily for the videos, that's a mesh head that I use. And the reason I use mesh is because I do a lot of playing and it's, it's taxing. I mean, it's still, you know, playing on a rubber pad or even on the drums, you're absorbing a lot of shock. So I feel the mesh in my daily practice and playing and, and filming and all that stuff, it's a lot easier on, on the hands. Um, and it, it's, it's, you know, longevity, right? So it's gonna help me not get too beat up as I continue to play for the next 30 years, hopefully. So there you have it, folks. Appreciate it. Let me know if you have any questions.